The life of a young wolf, which is part of a scientific trial in Devon, has been saved by groundbreaking surgery. Moby is one of six wolves which are being monitored as experts try to see if the species can be reintroduced into the wild in the UK. He broke his hind leg and, as Hamish Marshall reports, that would normally have meant he would have to be put down. But two local vets stepped in to help. It's hard to spot the difference between Moby and his five brothers and sisters. And that's a success in itself. Just over a month ago, his life was in the balance after he injured his leg. We had to go in there and isolate him, uh, put him out with the dart so that we could get hands on, give him a proper uh, examination. Uh, when we did that, we discovered that he had a severe fracture, uh, which was essentially a life-ending injury. But George and vet JJ Van Dyke didn't want to give up on Moby. So they tried an operation which isn't known to have been carried out before. If this was a dog, it would be even then a quite a tricky operation, but you would then try and keep him quiet for at least three, four, five weeks. Lead exercise, uh, bandages, one of those nice lampshade cones on them, that sort of thing. Doing that with a wolf is just a complete non -starter. So it's never going to heal by itself. It was Joe Fox who tried and to get a leg, Moby, so obviously Moby. broken, back into working order. He's operated on a lion before, but not a wolf. Surgery itself was tricky. The, we were trying to not disturb the biological side of things for, the, for where the fracture was, you know, the healing tissues, um, and then putting the metal implants that were going to be strong enough, so we had that metal plate put down the side and then the one down the front to hold everything in place. Once the anaesthetic wore off, Moby didn't fancy putting his feet up for a few weeks. If a wild animal is excluded for even a short period of time, it can cause problems when it's reintegrated. But 24 hours after his operation, Moby couldn't wait to get back with the pack and they seemed quite happy to welcome him back. We knew it was a risk, but we basically uh, relied on Moby's ability to stand up for himself once the operation was complete, and he's done a fantastic job of that. It's not known how Moby suffered the injury, although the pack members have been vying for seniority. But apart from the odd hobble and a shaved leg, he's taking his near-death experience in his stride. Hamish Marshall, BBC Spotlight, Escott and East Devon.